Ian, second pre-season friendly and a 1-0 result against Luton. What are your thoughts? Um, again, yeah, very pleased with the uh, with the 90 minutes. Um, as we've said before, it's all about getting match fitness at the moment. And certainly in 30 degree heat, a lot of the players felt it towards the last sort of 15, 20 minutes. Um, but to get the result was a nice result. To get a clean sheet was nice. Obviously, there's some areas there we need to go and work on over the next sort of six, seven weeks before the start of the season. And that is again scoring goals. As I say, it must be difficult playing against two different 11s uh, for the 90 minutes. Yeah, we've said that before, um, especially at half time, because it was it was the last sort of 20 minutes of the first half. They got on top and put on a bit of pressure, and we, you know, a few of them had little niggles today um, from from Wednesday night. I mean, like little little dead legs and, and knee injuries and calf muscles, and uh, we had to just sort of patch people up second half, and it become difficult, but you know, magnificent the way they they battled second half, and as I say, James Russell had a fantastic second half and made some good saves. Indeed. Uh, again, the uh, Pace Academy boys did well. You must be pleased with the progress they're making. Yeah, I mean, obviously, there, there's sort of three or four there that we we sat down at the end of the season and said these are the boys that we've got to bring forward into the first team squad, um, and they've done very, very well. They give us an energy, they give us legs, and uh, they, you know they're going to be very much a part of what, what we're trying to do this year. And as you said, uh, James also had an excellent game in goal, sort of carrying on from where he left off last year. Yeah, I mean that's that's what James is good at. I mean he's a fantastic shot stopper and. Uh, we know what he's like. Um, he's going to make those saves, you know, and we've just got to obviously keep protecting him, get him, keep them away from him as much as we can. But, you know, they're going to get shots in now and then. And when they do, we know we've got a good shot stopper behind them who's kept us in the game, you know, for certainly two or three times today. But defensively, I thought it was fantastic because Ben had to come off at half time and Mark Bentley went back in at centre half. Callum Reynolds wasn't around, so we had to go and put Luke Garrard in at right back. So it was a bit of a makeshift back, back four, but they defended very, very well second half. I say Ben Nunn went off at uh, half time. Was it due to injury or was it just due to uh, tiredness? Just a bit of a calf strain. He picked it up sort of Wednesday and it settled down. And, you know, he was fine for sort of 20, 25 minutes and he started to struggle up to half time. So at this stage of the season, we don't want to take a chance with anyone at the moment. Right. Thank you, Ian.